Here is a quick demonstration of our subtitle editor and AI dubbing feature. Here I open the editor with subtitles and video, and they are synchronized so I can preview them and listen to the original video. Here is an example. First, I need to select the source language, the original language of the material I want to translate. In this case, it's English. Let's translate it into French and Spanish. Now I can make changes to the source text. I can also make changes to the time codes. Furthermore, I can adjust them on the timeline. Here I will split the segment by lines. So now I have three lines and then I want to merge these two together. Now I have a perfect cue. I can listen to the subtitles with an AI voice. The original video has a female voice. I can now preview it with a new AI voice. First, I need to select the source language, the original language of the material I want to translate. Now this allows you to upload the video with some raw audio, but then adjust the script and then export this with a perfectly AI-generated voice. You can also do the same for a translated version. Next, I'll be using English as a source language and translate that into Spanish. Once I have the translations, I can do exactly the same to the translated version. For example, I can hear that specific cue in an AI voice. En primer lugar, tengo que seleccionar el idioma de origen, el idioma original del material que quiero traducir. En este caso, es inglés. If I'm happy with the translation, I can make further changes to the entire structure of the Spanish subtitle based on the needs of that language, regardless of the source language video. Here, I can split the text in this queue but keep the original structure in English. Once I'm happy with the structure and the translation, I can start with the AI dubbing. The process takes less than a minute and once it's done, you will be able to download the resulting fully AI dubbed video file. I can also track the progress in SmartCat Drive. Here, I had an original English version of that file in the subtitles. Now, I can download subtitles in both English and Spanish. We can also see that the Spanish version is being processed. This is how you can quickly create multilingual videos without leaving SmartCat.